Governor Abbott says the Texas power grid is holding up and performing well. There are isolated outages throughout the state, but he says those are due to iced up or down power lines and not related to the stability of the grid. The Texas electric grid is more reliable and more resilient than has ever been. And we have more on why the grid held up during the Arctic blast. Investigative reporter Jeremy Rogowski joins us with some key takeaways. Jeremy. Yeah, a big reason, Mia, is Texans simply didn't use as much juice as projected. Take a look. The actual power demand down here turned out to be much lower than what ERCOT had forecasted up there. That gap shows you just how much lower. And there are some other factors, too. Texas got a relative kiss from Mother Nature compared to last February's black eye. We were very fortunate. Had it been 10 to 15 degrees colder, we would have had extra demand and we would have had more stress on that supply. Electricity supply held on all fronts. Wind power outperformed projections. Newly winterized gas fired plants didn't fail like last year. We have no confirmed outages of any equipment related to weather. And as for natural gas supply to those power generators. The system is working as it should. It all made for a large margin of safety between available supply and demand. A comfortable cushion to keep the lights on. Enough extra power to supply more than 3 million homes across the state. Governor Abbott also says ERCOT has improved power plant maintenance schedules and many have added alternative fuel options. Overall, the governor says there's an extra 15 percent extra power capacity to the grid this year over last. Mia. All right. Very good news. Thanks so much, Jeremy.